Hello everyone, and my name is Rad Brad, and I'm just sitting here in my house. I once belonged to an alcoholic cult. We kept Kool-Aid in our flask. But today, you know, I've just gotten off work, and... You know, like, I love working at McDonald's, you know? I love having something to do, but I really like the people I work with, and I really like what I do. Like, sometimes it can get a little hectic, but, you know, I'm okay with that. I just don't like, you know, standing around, not doing something, or waiting for something to do, and... You know, I've been going hard in the grease and, you know, working fast and all that. Since like 7.30 this morning, I just got off. It's, well, I got off at 3.15 p.m. Took a 30 minute break, about three hours in. And today, like, you know, when I first started working, I had to wear, well, I didn't have a back brace and it was very difficult on me. And I only worked for like four hours and 15 minutes. And so I went to my grandma's and got a back brace to help me, like, you know, with keeping from my, my back from hurting. And I can't claim it's because of being old. Because I had the same issue when I was 24 when I worked at uh, Wendy's. For like a month. And. Uh, and it's a good thing that I worked 4 hours 15 minutes. And then 4 hours 30 minutes. And then 6 hours. And then got up to 8 hours a day. Because like now. You know like today I wore my back brace until... It was time for my lunch. I mean, well, time for my break. And it was just, it was itchy me so bad. So I just took it off because I felt like it was going to be more of a hassle than actually useful. And my back, you know, really doesn't hurt. Like, it's kind of hurt earlier whenever I was, like, constantly doing stuff. Like, my feet kind of hurt, but, like, it all, it all heals up by the next day. So, it's fine. Was there anything else I was wanting to say? I don't think so. Well, I'm going to be reviewing. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Let me get my towel in my lap so, you know. You know, it's like, like you know, napkin kind of thing, but, you know, it's a towel. You're a towel. And I'm going to be reviewing this uh, double quarter pounder with cheese. And, you know, like I said before, I'm not review, bro. I'm not going to tell you what's what's all on it. Mm. Oh, good. No pickle. I mean, like, I don't think pickle belongs on a, on a sandwich or on anything except by itself. But, like, kosher dill and, like, it's just, it's just worthless trash. Like, I like sweet pickles, like sweet gherkins and stuff like that, but... When it comes to kosher dill and hamburger chips, I guess, they're just, they're just not good. And I've had, yeah, I've, I've said it before. I've had some experiences ruined, you know, like blah, 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 blah. But uh, I'm going to go ahead and give this a try. And it's had about 15 minutes to cool down, which I think food tastes better when it's cooled down. Or if, like, say I put it in the fridge, like, unless it's mashed potatoes or biscuits, I don't heat it up in the microwave. It's... I just don't think it's good that way. Like, I'd rather just eat it cold, like pasta or meat, something like that. But I'm going to go ahead and give this a try. Mm. Oh, that's really good. Now, like, I worked the grill section and fry station and, like, anything else that I've been trained to do that I know how to do. And it really surprised me because I thought, like, McDonald's and places like that just had pre-cooked food and then it was heated up. But, like, since working there, I found out that we actually cook raw meat. Like, raw chicken. Uh raw beef and like i was very surprised about that i don't know if all mcdonald's do that but the one i'm at does which i think is very cool and i also learned that a franchise is like a place like mcdonald's or something like that that's owned by a normal person it's not like corporate ran like you know of course the people that own mcdonald's get some of the money or get money for it but like it's actually owned by a normal person i thought a franchise meant like a brand like 
McDonald's is a franchise, Burger King is a franchise, KFC is a franchise, but now like, they're like, hey, look at me, I'm learning new stuff. And I learned that like, these quarters, like it's like a quarter pound of beef. Now like, say if you get something like a McDouble or just a normal hamburger or even a Big Mac, we have these things called reg, which it took me a little while to figure out that reg is regular meat. Which is just like a little tiny, you know, piece of beef. Like, there's not much to it. It's basically a slider. But something like this, like, like, that's a quarter pound of beef. So this is a half pound sandwich and I'm going to eat it all. But this is the only thing I've had today and might be the only thing I'll have. I'll see. But, uh. Well, I think I've rambled, you know, rambled, man. I think I've rambled on a little, you know, a little too long. So, uh, rad, rad. Sun in my face.